Bless up, and welcome back to our channel. Today we will be looking at Haile Selassie I's speech on Literacy Day. Conscious of the fact that reading, writing, and knowledge of simple arithmetic are among the national literacy. Basic education is the most vital tool we have had to offer to the new Ethiopia and new Ethiopians. A great deal of our time and the country's resources have been devoted to this noble task ever since we assumed the leadership of the nation. As history attests, our efforts to this end were directed towards expanding our educational heritage. We have given priority to education over the various pressing national tasks. That was why we personally held the portfolio of the Ministry of Education until very recently. We had to bear patiently, innumerable challenges when laying the basic structure for modern education in Ethiopia. We are gratified to note today that the example we set has been widely followed by our people in a self-help education scheme. Our lifelong efforts, therefore, have borne satisfactory fruits. When we recall the difficulties our people faced in the past in trying to adjust to the modern educational system and their unequivocal embrace of it today, when we see young men and women who were students only yesterday, but who today are engaged actively in the various fields of national development efforts, and when we observe those who needed help in the past extending help and educating others, we are happy and grateful to Almighty for blessing our efforts. Although our people have to come to appreciate immensely the value of modern education, there is much more to be done in this field. We shall continue to work harder until illiteracy is wiped out. We once said that an educated person shall never be inferior to his fellow man. This encouraged various organizations to work for the promotion of higher education of their employees and thousands of individuals to improve their livelihood through evening classes. The general development we envisage for the country and the high standard of living we want all Ethiopians to attain cannot come about without education. Throughout our life, we have consistently maintained that education is the only weapon with which the noblest national tasks can be accomplished. International peace and economic development are being hampered by the increasing rate of illiteracy in the world today, particularly in developing countries. Because of this, world leaders and international organizations, especially UNESCO, are waging a relentless war against illiteracy. International Literacy Day, which is being observed worldwide today, bears witness to global endeavors. We will continue to collaborate in the fight against our common enemy, illiteracy, both at national and international levels as we have done in the past. It has been some time since war was declared on illiteracy in this country. In the last five years alone more than 750,000 men and women have achieved literacy mainly through the efforts and cooperation of the Ministry of Education and various voluntary organizations. About 3 million adults are expected to become functionally literate in the next five years and thereby contribute to the overall national development as envisaged by the third five-year plan. This can become a reality only when teachers, students, and educated Ethiopians in general voluntarily teach adults. They must be prepared for this voluntary scheme. Our forefathers left us a heritage of a written alphabet, of which we are all today proud benefactors. It is our cherished hope that this historic heritage will pass to generations to come. Ethiopia has been the traditional torchbearer of African freedom. What she must accomplish today in the fields of modern education and national development must be infused into this historical context. Our people must be aware of this. We therefore urge all those who are educated to teach others less fortunate to strive to seek the skills of literacy. We thank the Almighty for his guidance in all our efforts for national development, the welfare of the Ethiopian people, and attempts to eradicate illiteracy. Thank you for watching, please like, share, and subscribe for more videos, and don't forget to support the links in the description below. Peace and love, we thrive together.